Hi, my name is Steven Martilli at freedomeducation.ca and today is Motivational Mondays with me, Steve Martile. So, how to follow through with your goals. So I got a great question via email and I want to answer the question right now so that we can get right to it. It says, Steve, I have some issues with starting things and not finishing. Any suggestions on how people like me can follow through and get their tasks done? Okay, so one thing for sure, the number one thing that I recommend to people is that the goal or the desired growth, the desired result that they want resonates with them. You know, there's nothing like having a crappy goal and committing to it and letting your friends and your family and everyone know about it and your coach know about it and then you don't even want to do it. So one thing for sure is make sure the goal resonates with you. It's got to be something that you want to do. That's number one. The second thing that I recommend to people is that once you know that you've got something that you really want is to find an accountability partner. And uh, this is something that I did myself actually uh, just not too long ago and I still do it once in a while depending on what the goal is, is that uh, when I went from blogging once a week to three times a week, so writing three articles a week, that was a stretch for me. That was something that I'd never done before. But I knew that to take myself to the next level is something I wanted to do. So what I did was I phoned up one of my best buddies and he was blogging at the same time and I said, you know what? I said, I would love for you to help me out here. I said, I just want you to just, you know, hold me accountable. Every week I'm going to submit you three articles. So what my friend did is he subscribed to my RS feed and he waited for them to come in his inbox and he watched. And if they didn't come up at Sunday, we had an agreement at Sunday by, I think it was seven o'clock, he phoned me up and said, Steve, what's going on? You know, you said you were going to submit these posts and you didn't. So it was a great way to keep me accountable and it got me to build momentum as I started going, I started to build the habit and once I built the habit, three articles a week was, you know, it was, it was really easy for me to do that. So, th so the third thing that I recommend to people is that they have a coach because that's how I got started. You know, coaching, what it did for me was it helped me create a structure because every week what would happen is that I was accountable to the coach. So I had to submit my actions for the week. And what I found from that accountability is that it got me into the habit of taking action every week. And what better way to create results is by taking action. And even more importantly, and I think this is what, this applies to all three areas, is that once you start to take action, once you're in resonance with the goal, you have accountability partner and you have a coach, is that you make completing a habit. Because there's nothing like taking a goal, setting it, and then not even getting it done. And the, the thing is, is that that becomes a habit for you. And it can be a habit. So what you want to do is you want to make completion a habit. And you want to make it a habit in every part of your life. And what I did is I started really small. You know, first it was just like completing the tasks I was working on at work. And, you know, sometimes I'd get interrupted with a phone call. And it would be like just finishing the phone call. It'd be like, you know, one minute, I'm just going to finish this phone call and I'll get right to you. And so when you make completion a habit then it always works for you in every part of your life. And so you start maybe by finishing a book and completing it from start to finish. You start by you know finishing an article from start to finish and by having a conversation from start to finish. And when you make every part of your life a completion and you make it a habit, it's inevitable that you will start to move towards your goals and your target will start to get in closer range to you. It's got to happen because you're making completion a habit. And that's the best advice I can give to anyone to help them fall through on their goals. I hope you enjoyed this video. My name is Steven Martile, and thank you for watching.